Hey y'all, and welcome back for more Tales of Legendia. I think that last video actually turned out pretty well. I'm going to adjust my mic a little bit. Sorry. <laughs> Alrighty, so this is the item shop right here. I don't really need to buy anything because I think we're pretty good. I found so much stuff as it is. Yeah, this should be good. Let's talk to people anyway, though. It looks like this store is still preparing to open. I wonder what it will be. Oh, this one over here? Welcome to the customization shop, craft shop, but uh, we're still getting ready to open. Oh, yeah. So, you can... Like, this place here is where you make the best weapons and armor in the game. Or, for some of your characters anyway. But, you don't get access to it until... Like, uber late in the game. <laughs> So, yeah, that's a thing. When in trouble, panacea bottles are the key. Just remember it won't cure the common cold or gingivitis. Well, darn it. I didn't mean to do that. Whoa. Welcome to the item shop. Get ready. We've got everything you need for your journey. You know I have to earn my... Uh, da, 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 for husband and stuff and things. Oh, wow. I, no, we're, we cannot afford this. Oh, shit. I need to get money for panacea bottles. I just remembered. We're in chapter one right now. But early, the the first, like, dungeon-ish area in Chapter 2, you are stuck with two, like, your party is just two people. Neither of them know how to, how to cure poison. They can't do it. And all the enemies there, of course, cause poison. So I'm going to need, like, a shit ton of these things. Oh, man. I, I can worry about that later, right? I, I, I will worry about it later. <laughs> I am lazy, and I don't feel like buying anything. Give some accessories. Cape. <laughs> I, 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 I know. I know. I know. I wasted everything I had, but I don't care. I, I want Sinnel to wear two capes at once. Deal with it. Okay. It's got a title, kind brother. Shirley's kind brother, not so nice to other people. So titles in this game are just another type of equipment. Like in the other Tales of games, uh, you get them from doing various things. Sometimes in battle, sometimes through the storyline, sometimes from side quests. And none of them are actually really that great, to be perfectly honest. They just barely augment your stats. That's all they do. So I, I don't think they're really anything particularly useful. You can go ahead and get them if you want, just for completion's sake, but... Otherwise, they're just kinda... there. <laughs> I, I really cannot walk down this. What? What happens if I try to leave the city? Because we're, like, at the entrance of it. I guess I'll just have to wait for... da da da. Fine. I wanted to see if I could go to the overworld map place thingamabob. But no. If we go in here, we'll go directly to the tavern, but through here is the inn. The tavern is basically like the basement of the inn. Ooh, another save point. I'm gonna take advantage of it. Yay. Okay. Hello, sir. Or ma'am. Molly. <laughs> I'm here to stock up on items. I'm going to the stores later. Uh-huh. That... Wait, where does this go? Employees only. Oh, well darn it. How much does it cost to stay here? 100. Well, <laughs> it, no. Shut up. I, I cannot afford this. Go away. I wasted all my money on fucking capes. Ugh. Hello. Elena, welcome. It's 100 gold a night. Please sign in if you'd like to stay. Is it worth investigating the rooms of the inn? It might be. Oh, look! They have fireplaces. How quaint, I guess. Hmm. Are all the rooms like this? Probably. They also only have three rooms. I mean, that's generally a thing with RPGs. The inns have no available space at all. <laughs> oh, well. Maybe that plant I just ran by has something. Maybe. 
Because th there, there's, there's nothing. There's nothing in here. <laughs> at all. Plant? Plant? No. Well, damn it. What about these? Nope. This inn is useless to me. No, oh, the horror. There's a clock here. How exciting. Well, let's go to the tavern. What's this tavern actually called? It has a name. Maybe the, like, bartender will tell me. Hey, are, do I really have to go back here to talk to you? Really? Welcome, we have drinks from all over the world and great music. Unfortunately, the musician is on leave at the moment. The musician appears here around the same time you can also... Around the same time the customization shop opens. A lot of things happen at one time during this game, and it's very late in the game. I don't want to say much about it because it's, you know, spoilery and stuff, so yeah. I'm hiding from work, don't tell anyone. That's great. What? The fountain? It's at the very end of the street. I know where it's at. Is it your first time here? Actually, yes. I've come here to unravel the mystery of the legacy. My first stop is the Misty Mountains. Oh, joy. Bridges connect the city's nine districts. The main street is lined with shops, and the fountain is the most popular spot. Well, I guess we should go there, huh? Can we go down here? It, there is something down there, I guess. That, that's yet another thing that unlocks the same time as the customization shop and Mr. Music Man, who is not here. I swear, everything happens. Like, everything unlocks at a specific point in this game. And I can't say anything about it, because it's, like, spoilery and shit. Uh. Well, I, I always keep thinking pushing the menu button will let me look at a map here, but no. You can't. I'm guessing she's in my way from going over here? Where are you going? Listen to what I'm saying. What are you saying? I wonder how long they're going to let those bandits run with the da da savages. You'll find what you're looking for at the Lighthouse Shopping District. Great. Is it true that a Marinus appeared? I keep hearing that rumor no matter where I go. Well, that's because it's a rumor, and people like to talk about absolutely everything that really doesn't even matter at all. Weapons aren't cheap, so make sure you really know what you want before you buy one. Well, I can't. Welcome to the... Uh, to champion the weapon shop owned by the VP of the Business Bureau, my brother's armor shop over there won't outsell us. Okay. Okay, so those are better for me? No, no, those those are what I have. These are better by, like, nothing, so... <laughs> not worth it. That is for somebody who's not in the party. Somebody who's not in the party. You are useless to me, sir. What about the armor shop? Phalanx. We pride ourselves in providing sturdy, well-crafted armors. Uh, somebody we don't have, somebody we don't have. Why is the cloak, like, so much better than everything else? What? Oh, hey, you have... Oh, damn it. I, I, I really, actually... I want this. But I can't have it. <laughs> Crap. I had to waste all my money on freaking capes. This because I wanted some spares for the party members we're about to get. Oh, well. Can we go over here? Nope. People in the way. Wait, what? Bandits have been sighted. Please keep watch. Okay. Priscilla. There's always a lot of people at the fountain that lies ahead. Well, it's kind of the central spot, so... Yeah. The map! Yeah, we're pretty much right there. We just head upwards. The entire, like, right half of the city... The, upward, the upper and right have areas of it. You cannot go to for the longest time, I tell you. Basically, everything I've run around and shown you is all you're going to be able to explore for many chapters of this game. They're fighting. Don't want to get myself in the middle of that. That's a good idea. Let's just... Let's stop <laughs> doing nothing. And actually, like, progress the plot. That might be a good idea. Oh, wait, hey, does that slide we saw earlier empty into this? It might. I bet it does. Well, there's, like, a lot of people here. That's great. Hello, sir. You have, like, a space-themed clothes. <laughs> Is this your first time in to speak 
Yes, it is. Sentinel is surprised, but does not care, <laughs> apparently. So, are you strong or are you not? Why does it even matter, sir? Seriously, why does it matter? No, I don't. <laughs> oh god, he's doing something. Guess what, sir? I have, like, ten. That's what this person just said! Mm-hmm. I'm sure I did. Hey, what are you trying to do? Well, he's being a bitch. That's what he's doing. <laughs> oh, hey, look, there's... And then she walked away. Oh, darn. Sounds like a good time to me. Yeah, I'll take you up on that. Get out of my way. I like how everybody just kind of shoved their faces in Sinnel's direction. <laughs> he has magic, and everybody's really surprised by this. He can use Eris. Interesting. Iron Eris, I presume. He certainly looks like the type who acts before he thinks. Come on now, folks. Don't hold back. It's 50,000 gold, remember? 50,000! Yeah, but still. Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's not like we can use Eris. Oh, shit. Hey, what's all the commotion about? <laughs> Remember those people I said we were going to meet in the last video? Could you run that by me again? <laughs> well. Get your hand off me. Okay. Hey, how could you... Do you realize what you've done? Do you know who this is? Yeah, well, he started it. Yeah, that's, that's, that's real nice, Sinnoh. There's nothing he hates more than someone interrupting his song! Uh-huh. I'm sure that's all he's upset about. Huh? <laughs> oh good, now he's gone insane. Well, I think he was insane before. Ooh, he's angry! Curtis is angry! Oh no! You're in trouble now! Look at me not give a fuck. <laughs> Yes, Curtis. Now I must harden my heart. I must swallow my tears. All for the sake of reforming this wayward youth. Yes, Curtis. Still, it must be done for the sake of love. Beauty is power! Great Bantam! Beauty is sin! Wonder Bantam! It's power and sin. Prepare yourself. We are the Phantom Bouncers. Oh, hell. What? Oh, defeat. So he 
stronger than the bouncers. Oh, hey, well, you missed everything. <laughs> Oh yes, more fighting. More fighting is always the answer. What's funny to me about that is that lightning, at least in battle, is pretty much the worst spell ever. <laughs> so, yeah, that's just, that's funny to me. Hello, ma'am. Yes, I have. Maybe should try to hold back a little more. It's good that he takes his job as a sheriff so seriously, but sometimes he takes things a bit too far. Now, now, let's not be spreading falsehoods, Madame Musette. My real occupation is that of a natural historian. I never claimed to be a sheriff. Let me out of here! Seems like you still haven't learned your lesson. Will told me about the situation. Would you mind if I asked you a question? What exactly is your relationship to Shirley? Shirley's... She's my little sister. I see. Then you must go save her, mustn't you? Will, why don't we let Senel go? But... He's just earnest, that's all. He can't help but be anxious. When your sister is in danger, you must run to her immediately, no matter where she is or what stands in your way. That is what brothers do, is it not? Don't blame me if he stirs up trouble again. Well then, why don't you accompany him? Is that an order? Just a suggestion, though now that I think about it... I believe a certain spirited young lady also headed off to Moses hideout. Chloe Vollins went there? Yes, and it seems she went alone. Do you think she'll be all right? So now I'm a babysitter. I guess I don't have much choice. Very well, I will help you get your sister back, since I now seem to have other business there as well. Senel seems so overjoyed. Nice, Senel. Um, thanks. You're quite welcome. <laughs> well, woohoo. Wasn't that just the most joyous thing that ever happened? Okay, what the hell do you have? You have lightning, which sucks all the ass, and then pretty much our only healing spell for, like way longer than should be necessary. <laughs> so, that's good. Okay, what do you have equipped, uh... Where do I go to... there. <laughs> you have the hammer, you have the robe, and then nothing. You can have two of my capes. Animal, vegetable, mineral, he knows it all. His vast knowledge supports everyone. Great. Well, alrighty then. Uh, hi. I'm happy for you, Sinol. I'm, I'm, that, uh, uh, thanks. I guess. <laughs> I, I don't really know what to say to that. I'm happy that you're going to go do stuff, I guess. Oh, hey, I just realized we're in, uh, Will's house. His basement is a dungeon for whatever reason. I don't really understand why. And just for funsies... At least until we leave this place, I'm gonna be Will, just because he's here. So, anything we can look at? Anything at all? Will, what the hell do you have in your house? Anything that might be useful? Probably not. You have, like, a lot of plants. 
sir. Why do you have so many plants? So hot water comes out of here. No matter who you're playing as, Sinnel's all the only one who ever has any comments for some reason. I don't understand why, but that's just how it is. Okay, so I'm seeing basically nothing of use in here. Nothing at all. We can cook here, I think. So, that's a thing. Where are we exiting to? Ah. Hi. <laughs> Sir, why do you have, like, a dead thing hanging in your house? I don't understand. Why? I don't think we can go in here. Yeah. And this, I think, would be Will's room? Maybe? Oh, hey, I actually did find something. Yay. And of course, your room has, like, nothing but books. Of course. Because you are the smart person of our group. Which consists of only two people at present, but... We'll get others soon. Eventually. Maybe. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. We are over 20 minutes. And I, I kind of want to keep all the videos not long. I mean, 20 minutes is kind of long, but... Maybe I should, like, stop at about 15? Oh, shit, we're having a cutscene. Damn it. Let's hurry to the bandit's lair. Will, I believe you've forgotten your map. Ah, uh, thank you. Yay. Take care of yourself, Sennel. When you return with Shirley... Let's all get together for tea. Oh, yes, let's. And that will just be the best thing ever. Let's go out for tea. Okay. Well. Um, I guess I'm gonna go run and save. Actually, wait a second. I, I'm never... I'm probably never going to play as Will because he's... He has magic and only magic. But I may as well kind of set him up. Um, I, I'll put lightning there, and then... Sure. Whatever. Uh, so in the next video, we're actually gonna start making progress... ...in the storyline... ...towards, you know, actually saving Shirley. We're finally gonna start doing that. Because there's, like, nothing left to do in town, so... I will see you then!